Hi, I'm Ben from the Antique Guild and today I'll be showing you my collection of Elsa Peretti terracotta pieces. When I first started working at the Antique Guild, one of the first pieces that I really liked and really caught my eye was a terracotta pitcher from the 70s that was designed by Elsa Peretti for Tiffany & Co. I didn't know who Elsa Peretti was, I didn't care who Tiffany & Co was, but I really liked the shape of it. It was so strange, it wasn't like something that you could pick up anywhere. The first pieces of Elsa Peretti that I got were these black terracotta candlesticks, these kind of smaller ones. Um, I found these on Etsy from a seller in the US who didn't really have anything like this. A lot of the other things she was selling were kind of little knickknacks or old ashtrays and things and this just must have been something she came along with so they were a very good price. I don't think she necessarily appreciated what they were. The other three pieces I got all at once. I got the bowl, this smaller candle holder, plus the, the two larger candlesticks. Um, and they actually came from a antique shop in Seattle in America. And when I was purchasing them, I asked if they knew what the provenance was, who had owned them last. And they'd only had one owner before me, and that owner was a window dresser for Tiffany in New York in the 70s. So it's very likely that she got these in the 70s when she was working with Tiffany and just kind of held on to them. Elsa Peretti was an Italian model in New York in the early 70s who was friends with Halston and did quite a lot of design for him. Um, and she was later introduced by Halston to Tiffany & Co and started designing pieces for them in, in 74. Um, she was designing jewelry, decorative arts, all sorts of pieces. The name of the series for these three pieces here is just called Bone. Uh, and she was obsessed with the form of uh, the human bone, the organic shape of it. Um, these are actually modeled after a femur bone in the leg. You're probably familiar with her work in the form of the bone cuff that she made in the 70s. It's usually in sterling silver. Um, and still quite popular today. The bowl here is from her thumbprint series. She did a whole range of dinnerware and decorative pieces with this, this thumbprint made to kind of be held in the hand very easily. Peretti is famous for being very particular when it comes to her designs, um, that she'll obsess and stew over the form of what she's making in that moment. Um, there's even a story that she is designing a cup that she's been designing for the last 20 years and just can't get it perfect. Um, so the items that you see here are as perfect as she could get them, I guess, before someone made her take them to manufacturing. Thank you for watching. I'm Ben from the Antique Guild. If you enjoyed this video, please consider liking and subscribing to the channel. We'd love to see you again.